Today I'm going to show you a quick and intuitive way to create pitched hi-hat rolls which can turn a basic loop into something special. Let's do it. What's up, this is Marcello. If you're interested in NPC tutorials just like this one, consider subscribing. And if you think these tutorials are helpful, leave a like in the comments. Make sure to check out the description for my free one hour MPC uh, masterclass and a lot more helpful stuff. All right, let's dive in. Uh, on track one, I loaded up one hi-hat. On track two, we got kick and snare. And on track three, or four different uh, tuned 808s. All right, let's start with the hats. Let's just um, make the BPM maybe 124. Let's start by copying this uh, hi-hat to several pads. So let's make it those eight pads. So let's hold copy, press the pad you want to copy, and then press all the pads you want to copy uh, it to. So we got it on eight different pads now. Um, next step, let's go to program edit and Let's set the polyphony on the master page to mono, or let's set it to two. That means two notes can be played at the same time, but not three. Um, all right, now let's go to samples, to this page. And now let's, uh, let's leave this hi-hat in its uh, original tune, but let's pitch this one down maybe six semitones then let's pitch this one up for four and this maybe up nine or eight this down 12 why not or maybe nine yeah and this one we can reverse and this one let's warp it and um, BPN sync is on and the uh, three semitones down so it sounds sounds okay what do we do with this one let's make it high all right now um, let's go back to main and now let's start with the simple uh, hi-hat pattern with the original hi-hat let's play it with 16 levels velocity so one is a little louder and one is a little quieter. Let's just play a, a, a simple basic pattern. All right. Now we got a simple pattern and now let's just activate the note repeat, shift note repeat. And now let's uh, just we can just add some head rolls to this one, and we already have. Yeah, let's just make some some tri tri uh, some uh, triplets. I don't like the sound of this one. Let's bring it up. Okay. Now let's add another uh, roll, maybe. All right, now let's, before uh, we move on with the hi-hats, let's just add a simple kick and snare pattern.
Okay, and maybe 1808. Okay, let's go back to the hi hat track and now let's go um, to track to pad mix double tap track mix and now uh, we can either add an auto pan to the whole program so the pads will be panned or we can just pan them differently so if we want this one maybe a little to the right and this one even more and maybe this one this one a little to the left maybe so we can just play around um, maybe also with the levels let's just make some of them quieter I don't like the sound of this one um, okay now, um, all right, now let's go to uh, program edit and go to the samples page, hit it two times, and here we can change the offset of this original hi hat. That means it will be delayed a little bit. How does it sound if we? put the polyphony to mono, that means only one hi-hat can be played at the same time. So mono. I think it, it's better with, with poly on two. Next, let's go to the XYFX page. Let's choose program, insert XYFX. And now um, we can add some F XYFX automation to those hi-hats. Um, for example, I, I really like the flanger. It's pretty fun, the flanger. I think flanger manual. So let's add just one of those. Automation is um, on. Let's press play start. Oh, that's spacey. Let's deactivate automation again. Alright, the only thing missing is a dope melody. If you want to make melodies that stand out and don't sound like the rest, make sure to watch this video. Um, I share six simple tips for creating uh, unique melodies on the MPC and standalone. So far this video has uh, received some great feedback, uh, so make sure to check it out. I'll see you over there. Peace.